Well, Cindy learned that 12 grams of suspected meth were found inside of the SUV on Boy Scout Road, as well as a loaded revolver, which was found directly under the two year old's car seat. But for the first time, we heard from the mother of the toddler who says it was all a misunderstanding. She was left without food and her dress on the inside looked like this and the outside looked like this. General Sessions Court Judge Lila Statham was not happy after hearing testimony surrounding the alleged kidnapping of two-year-old Octavia Shaw. So this is not grandfather of the year. This is somebody who was leaving and didn't want to be caught. But the toddler's mother and grandmother disagree. Ava Cole testified calling the whole ordeal a misunderstanding, saying Matias Martinez didn't know she was on her way to pick up her daughter. It was a, a miscommunication in terms of what my options were. Either I was to let him just kind of find his way in a place that I know he doesn't know very well with my child, or I would ask for the police's help and press the kidnapping charges. Hamilton County Deputy Andrew Standifer testified about the traffic stop, saying he asked Martinez to take Octavia out of the car while he was arresting the child's grandmother on an outstanding warrant. I had originally asked him to sit in my air-conditioned vehicle. With the child? The, with the child to wait for the uh, mother. Um, Mm -hmm. He didn't want anything to do with that. Deputies allowed Martinez to sit in the shade under a tree across the street, but then they say he disappeared with the toddler. He was taken into custody about a mile from the scene. 14 hours later, investigators testified Octavia's condition looked like she had spent the night outside. Now, the judge chose to keep Martinez's bond at $171,000. Tonight, Octavia remains in state custody. Her mother is trying to get her back. In the studio, I'm Michelle Heron, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.